So I'm sitting here just, you know, chilling out for a bit and I am online shopping. I suppose I could be reading, but you know, sometimes you need a break from a break. Uh, anyway, I have been looking for a full length mirror. We need one for our house. Like no room in our house has a full length mirror. It's really weird. We haven't had a full length mirror in years actually. Uh, but I want one, and so I'm looking for one. And now, if you have been around at all, you'll know that I mentioned quite a bit that I don't have a lot of room to store physical books, which is why I try not to buy too many physical books. And so in my search for a mirror, my big brain was like, maybe there's a mirror that spins around and the back side of it is a bookshelf. And of course, me being me, I found one. So this is the one that I found. It is the beautiful full length mirror, uh, swivels to reveal some storage. I know this looks like it is for a bathroom, but you know, shelves work for whatever you want them for. But not for $330. And so, you know, when you're on Amazon, as I am, uh, they give you like suggested similar products. And I came across this one. And I think it might be perfect. It's adjustable shelf height. And it spins so it's two sided, double the shelf room. And then I was just my big brain again. I can just stick a freaking full length mirror on, on the side, right? And that should work. And a fraction of the cost, I mean, yeah. My husband always gives me a funny look when I bring new pieces of furniture into the house, but I think if I can make this work, he will not be bothered by it. And yeah, so I'm gonna add this to my cart and two we'll see thousand how that goes. years later. So I'm calling it quits on work. I got my tools and I am finally going to put together this bookshelf thing that I bought in September. Yeah, because I have a lot of books that I ordered that need a- And there it is. Man. I do have to play with the shelf spacing a little bit, but. Book storage solutions for those who don't have a lot of space. I get double the shelf. And to make it extra stealthy, I have one more thing to add.
And the finishing touches is I attached a suit, like a $7 Target mirror. So, incognito, full-length mirror, check out your outfit. You want some books? Oh, oh, you want some books? Bam. Bam. Books. Oh, you, you don't like those selections? Oh, more books. Tell me that this is not a super freaking cool bookshelf stealth multi-purpose idea. I'm actually really impressed that I was able to think of this. Yep. Hey guys, it's Kristen from the future, editing Kristen. Uh, I didn't close out that last clip because I guess the excitement from this bookshelf was just too much for me to handle. Uh, I'm gonna leave the link to that bookshelf down below for anyone who might want one because I think it's a really cool idea, especially for those of us who don't have space for like the bigger traditional bookshelves. Um, and if you're one of those people who don't have space for a traditional bookshelf, please let me know how you store your books because this is gonna fill up really soon and I'm gonna need some more ideas. And if you're a person who does have a traditional bookshelf, uh, just leave a wine glass in the comments because I like to know that you've been here. If you like this video and you wanna see more of me and my bookish nonsense, I would love if you would consider giving this video a thumbs up and subscribing to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.